Hey guys, Fazgard here. As an addition to the ADW Launcher Wiki, this video will show off some basic features that can be added to the home screen. First off, ADW Launcher makes it easy to customize the amount of home screens you want. Simply hit the menu button and then edit. A visual representation of the home screens you have will be shown. The green buttons will add new screens on the right or left of the current visible screen. The yellow buttons on the bottom shift the current screen right or left. The red bottom button deletes screens, and the top yellow button pins the current screen as the default. Widgets are a staple of the Android platform, and ADW Launcher makes it easy to place them the way you want. Hold on the home screen to open the Add dialog box. Pick Widgets. ADW Launcher organizes the widgets list and groups together sets from the same app, making it easier to find the right widget you want. Find it, then select it. Before it's placed, another dialog box will ask you to define the size. The widget's default size is shown first, in case you don't want to change it. For now, I'll let it be normal. But say later I want to change the size. Many widgets support scaling and can be resized to fit your needs. Press and hold on your widget to open the options bubble. From here, you can remove it from your home screen, edit the size, and uninstall the widget. I want to resize the music widget, so I hit edit. From here, there will be four buttons you can drag around to resize your widget. When you're done, hit the back button to set it. If you're tired of the widget and want to get rid of it, you can press and hold and either press the remove button or drag it to the trash and let go. Simple. Creating and editing shortcuts has never been easier. EDW Launcher provides a great set of menus that allow you to change every aspect of them. Let's start with editing a shortcut. I have a shortcut of an alarm clock app I have, but my theme doesn't yet have an icon for it, so it still has the base icon showing. This is boring, so let's change it. Just like the widget editing, press and hold on the icon to bring up the command bubble, and hit edit. This is the custom shortcut menu, which allows you to both create and edit home screen shortcuts. I want a new icon, so let's press the icon button, which also shows a preview of the icon it is set as. Now we can choose an icon with three options. Select a pre-sized icon you may have from the gallery, select an image from the gallery and crop it to size, or pick one from an icon pack you may have. I have the Flux theme installed, so I want to pick one from there so it matches the rest of the icons. Suddenly I have access to all the icons in the icon pack. Tons to choose from, huh? For this though, I'm going to go with the generic A icon, since A is for alarms. Bam, the icon is selected. You can also change the name of the shortcut, but I'll get to that in a second. Press OK to save your changes. This is all well and good, but now I want a shortcut that goes right to the alarm settings screen. With ADW Launcher, you can. This time, I'm going to create a custom shortcut. Press and hold on the screen and pick custom shortcut in the menu. Now we're back to the menu screen where we were editing the alarm app icon. Before we change the icon again, let's pick the activity. Here we have a choice of a ton of options to launch with the shortcut. Regular apps, specific activities, ADW launcher actions, other commands the Android platform has included for use, or shortcuts that apps have added. For what I want to do, I will need the activities menu. Opening this selection brings me to a list of activities every installed app can open. This allows us to pick all kinds of specific pieces of apps to launch. Not every activity works as a shortcut, so try them out and see what you can do. I want to open the alarm settings menu with the shortcut, so I'm going to pick the clock app and open its tree. Here I see a list of commands I can open from within the app. There's settings, so let's pick it. ADW sets the activity and returns to the custom shortcut box. Again, we pick a new icon. The fluxed clock works for this. Now, settings, as a title, is pretty generic, so let's make it a little easier to identify. Changing it to alarm settings is easier to get. Then press OK. Now you have a custom shortcut that goes right where you want it to, all from the home screen of ADW Launcher. Play around with these options and create the setup you've always wanted. See ya!